It's one of my baby's first birthdays and we are celebrating, going all out, even though he has no clue what's going on. But he'll be happy because he's getting lots of toys and food. I'm gonna be dropping dollar bills, y'all, on anything I see in some of my favorite, most classy stores that I think Little Butters would want. So let's head to the first destination, my favorite place, Ross. Ross usually has some great stuff for my dogs for extremely cheap. And you guys know I love cheap. And I will usually find at least one thing that I know my dogs will want to cuddle or destroy. But today, nothing. Absolutely nothing. I went to the bed so maybe I can get him a cool new bed because I love this little evil lair cave thing But it's just felt super cheap and I can probably find something in better quality I did find an acrylic paint and black canvas set for myself because I'm getting into abstract art Oh and a purse and two backpacks because I literally don't own a purse and the only purse I have is a costume slash prop purse and my backpack is busted I've had it since I was 20 so I got a red backpack for Disneyland and a base basic black and then I thought this purse was pretty cute and for the vegans out there it says it's vegan so if that's important to some of you that's was at Ross so after all of that there was nothing at Ross and I ended up just spending hundred dollars on myself because I'm a horrible mom but there's still hope because we are going to have a butters birthday bash and it's gonna be his best birthday bever because it's his first birthday. There's still PetSmart, so let's go in. No expense is too much for my children. PetSmart did not disappoint. Who would have thought that a pet store would have a lot of pet toys that my dogs would love? I saw these cute cat toys that would just be perfect for his small, tiny ass mouth. I got a pickle, hot sauce, and a taco because that's his native traditional food. I saw this bed and yes, it's unicorn and pink and my dog is a boy, but he wouldn't know and I don't think he would actually care. He just wants a cool bed to lay his little body on and uh, it's 29. 99. Yeah, no. No expense is too much for my children. I came across these little guinea pig costumes that were half the price of the actual dog costumes and since Butters is small, I think he can fit in them. So I decided to get them and right then and there, make Butters party a Halloween extravaganza costume party. I got a tons more gifts and threw them in the cart because remember, no expense is too much of an expense for my baby. And then I went to the frozen section because they need ice cream and it's pumpkin and cinnamon flavor so a very festive for our favorite time of year and what's a birthday party without cake or pie so now it's time to party time to set up our extravagant party decorations they hated it They hid, but we worked through it and had to just end up moving all the balloons because it was too scary for Butters. And he refused to stay in that general area. He is the first. <laughs> stay, 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 stay. Oh God, you asked. <laughs> well, now we have to get our costumes on before all the guests come and we did it. Kind of. And now for the guests. And we're all here. Time for the gifts. Butter's favorite seemed to be the duck toy. And it's Yoshi. And Yoshi absolutely loved the Kong Cheese Whiz. She also thought the party was for her and these were all her toys because she's a selfish ass bitch and that's why we all love her. And technically, let's be real, they are for her. Butters loves her so much is that he will share absolutely everything except for chew sticks. Stop! <laughs> it's not your birthday. Which brings me to the next toy. I got this tiny little toy that makes it harder to get treats and you fit the treat in there and it kind of keeps your dogs off your ass and busy trying to get the toy out. They didn't like it at first or just didn't pay attention to it at first because they wanted Cheese Whiz or their other toys, but eventually Butters thought it was a very special toy to him and didn't even let Yoshi get near it. He also liked the Kong Street Holder. It was also very special to him and also would not let Yoshi get near to it and would run from my boyfriend because he thought that he would take his special new toy. Toy. Well, now it's time for cake, and my dogs love whoop cream. Yes, whoop 
cream. So they don't get it often, but today is a special occasion. The store only had a number two, so that's what I got. <laughs> the dogs absolutely loved the cake, but I had a special surprise that they would never expect. A full 2021 Mercedes that I got at a garage sale for free because it doesn't work. Dreams really do come true, and they actually jumped out immediately and went back to the cake spot. Thank you everyone for coming to Butter's birthday bath. He really appreciates all the gifts of... Wait, you, you didn't bring a gift? For our special boy, well, you could just hit the subscribe button and it would cancel all of that out. Thank you so much for visiting us and we will see you guys in the next video. I can feel my body cold against the concrete, but I can't seem to get enough. My mind is fixed on what it wants. I just let you beat me, look at me deceiving, let you get the best of me, in bed with my worst enemy. This is a no pro. I just can take cold. This is a danger zone. Back up.